Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau says he will stay in the race for re-election despite public anger over images that show him wearing blackface. Trudeau said last night he deeply regrets his actions, with, which happened before he got involved in politics. Jamie Yukis is outside the Canadian Parliament building in Ottawa. Jamie, how are these blackface photos affecting Trudeau's campaign? Well, it depends who you talk to, Tony. Good morning. Throughout his political life, Trudeau has portrayed himself as a champion for racial equality and diversity. But some political observers say these newly released images could hurt his reputation and credibility and potentially sway key swing voters. What I did um, was inexcusable and wrong. With Election Day just over a month away, Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau spent Thursday night again apologizing to voters and asking for forgiveness. And I am deeply, deeply sorry. Trudeau is on the defensive after three photos and a short video of him in blackface decades ago emerged over the past two days. Darkening your face is always unacceptable because of the racist history of blackface. I should have understood that then, uh, and I never should have done it. The first photo of Trudeau was published Wednesday, taken in 2001, when he was a 29-year-old teacher attending an Arabian Nights party. The prime minister then admitted to performing Deo, a traditional Jamaican song in blackface when he was in high school. And on Thursday, a video of Trudeau also in blackface surfaced. A government official says it was taken in the early 1990s. Trudeau's political opponents say his actions were unacceptable. What we're seeing now is an ongoing pattern of behavior that's really going to hurt Canadians. They're going to see the Prime Minister uh, mocking the realities that so many Canadians live with. It's what you would call a real political bombshell. Tonda McCharles is covering next month's election for the Toronto Star. He and his main opponent are neck and neck in most polls. Now with this, the Conservative opponent of Justin Trudeau does not need to win a whole lot of votes. What's striking is how polarizing Justin Trudeau is here in Canada. The people I spoke with either love him or say their negative feelings are validated by the scandal. It could tarnish his legacy as well as his family's. His wildly popular father, Pierre Trudeau, served as Canada's prime minister twice in the 60s through the 80s. Anthony. All right, Jamie Yukas in Ottawa this morning. Thanks, Jamie.